The Google Translate extension is a great tool for in-the-moment translations, especially when using things like websites. Add the Google Translate extension from the Chrome Web Store. Add the extension, and then it'll show up on your extensions bar. To use the extension, you may need to access it from the puzzle piece, pin it so it shows up regularly. When you're on a website that you'd like to translate, click the extension and click Translate. A little bar shows up at the top. You can use the drop-down to select a language to translate the website into. The content on the website should change into that language. Click on the extension each time you navigate to a different part of the website to translate the text on that page. In Options, you can turn off translations if you want to go back to English. In your Chrome extension options, you can choose your primary language and set it there. You can also decide how you want the pop-up extension to function. You have three choices. In the translate box through the extension, you can also type in a single word and it'll translate it into your chosen language. You can click on the little speaker to listen to it. And then you can also open up Google Translate, the web browser version to explore more things with that language and that word. I can also find a word that I don't know, highlight it, and then use the extension to translate that single word into my language. I can click on the speaker to hear it, and I can click on the speaker to hear it in English as well. From here, I can open it in Google Translate or continue to read the article in English. This is great for in-the-moment translation of single words. If I click on an article, I can then use the extension to translate the article. The article will get translated right in place, so I can then read the article in my home language and then switch back to English 